Hey guys, it's me again. Oops, I almost dropped my phone. I'm missing miracles and I'm back with another video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to support my channel and help me grow. I'm just going to be picking up some or picking up a tool for my business so I can make products easier. This is what I needed. I found it right away and I can't wait to use this. Okay, so that was fast in and out. I got what I wanted. This, I was just with my madre as well and my mother and I was taking her to run errands and then she was like, you know what? Just take me back home now. So, and she also got me food because I'm hungry, but. And I need to eat it now before it goes bad. I got like an enchilada case looking case of, I got an enchilada looking burrito. She got me a quesadilla and a burrito. And then they give you free chips and salsa because they're nice. Y'all know I love Mexican food. But this is really messy. I was hoping for, um, excuse me, I have a, a hangnail. I broke my nail. I chipped it. And I need hand sanitizer because I forgot I just went to the store. Anyways. I was hoping for a burrito that I can eat with my hands, you know? But I guess they decided to put the toppings on it. It's a bean burrito. No steak or chicken. This is what it looks like, and that's why I said before it goes bad because it's already like melted and stuff. Let's try it. Refried, refried beans. Refried, refried bean burrito. With um, cheese, jalapeno, sour cream, and red salsa and avocado I didn't even um, make my smoothie yet what did I do this morning when I got up? Oh, I fed my dogs, took them out to pee, and um, fed my dogs. Took them out to pee and poop, then fed them, and then I got in the shower. Yeah, that's how I got my day started. No smoothie, I drank some water, no tea. Ooh. And I made a post and then I started um, editing my content. That's what I started doing so that I could, so that I can record my smoothie of the day video. <laughs> smoothie of the week. Cause I don't know if y'all noticed, but I like to post one video and then three shorts. So my last video was posted and I had to upload three shorts. So I woke up and started making shorts after yeah all that um short short shorts that's that well i ate some of this and now i'm about to go driving because i'm all the way on the other side of town i'm about to go back home i'm so happy that they had it here because the other location the other Michael's location didn't have the tool that I needed. So I called this place before I came in. I was like, you guys have it? And they're like, yeah, we have two in stock. That was kind of already on this side of town. Mm -hmm. So 
it worked out perfectly everything's working out all right guys i'm gonna see you in the next clip with my fat grease self <laughs> i just had to eat a little bit before i got back on this road and i didn't want it to go cold all the way y'all know they only give me one napkin it's fine i don't need it oh well, i already used it but i don't i don't need it really because is there any, anything on my face not really all right thank you so much for uh supporting me bye hey guys i'm back to show you how to use the tool that i got i want to clean off the surface of the tumbler i'm so excited go ahead and open it up and take out all of the components it's so small and yeah these are the little different tips i guess and this is the stand to hold the tool so i'm going to plug it in and before i do that i'm going to read the instructions so basically they said to find the tip that you need and i'm just showing you some different sizes i'm finding one to match the uh epoxy that little thing that i made <laughs> epoxy chip i'll call it a chip so find one that fits that one that'll be a little bit smaller and they said to just screw it in and then yeah i guess i skipped over some instructions because <laughs> i didn't realize that it was a button on the back of the tool that you turn on not on the back on the bottom of it so <laughs> I let it sit and I thought I could use it, but no. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on and wait like a couple minutes and let it heat up. Say about five minutes, three to five minutes is a good time. So here it's heated up and I'm gonna go ahead and position the tool like towards the edge of the cup and inside of that little ring. And here's another view that you can see. It's heating up and it was really quick to use and easy. And it's like, <laughs> yeah, I was just so happy because it's not as dangerous as using the drill. And it took like Perfect 20 seconds. hole, perfect hole. I'm so excited, this will definitely help me open um the bottom of the tumbler perfect easily. hole no dangerous drill i think it's a best the best investment <laughs> thanks for watching